So I grab my chair here with my right hand. Close your feet together. I hope you're ready <laughs> for the last part today. So roll your shoulders back and down. Soften your rib arches. Powerhouse is active. We're gonna lift and lower the heels. So roll away as we did it before a few times. So press your heels together. How not to do it. Protect your outer ligaments. Good. When you got that, speed it up. Lift, lift, but with power. Don't let yourself drop uh, to the floor. Always work with power, with muscle power. Maybe work without stabilizing yourself at the bar. Stretch your legs. Core is active, Whoa, burning calf muscles. Four, three. Two, keep your heels in the air, bend and stretch both legs. Let's go, bend and stretch, bend and stretch. What is important here? Keep ears, shoulders, hips and heels in one line, down and up. So imagine you're leaning against the wall and your shoulder blades are still touching the wall. How not to do it? Stay upright. Good, amazing. Let's go for eight more. Squeeze the thighs together. Squeeze the heels together. Be great, tall and beautiful as you are. Four more. Three. Two. Stay bent, hold it low. Now release the outer foot and we're gonna go for rond de jean. Move it back to front and bring it together. So we're gonna extend the rond de jean to the back. It's a half circle to the front and close your feet together. Let's go double time. Front, back, front, and close. Good. Stabilize yourself with your bar or chair, whatever you have at home. Keep your standing leg active and your heel in the air. Let's go. Four more rounds. Don't move your hips. Both pelvic bones are facing forward. Shoulders above your hips. Last one. Hold your leg at the front, we're gonna lift and lower. Eight, seven. If it's too much for your ankle, then drop your weight, uh, your heel. Good. Now, keep your leg high and we're gonna pulse it for eight, seven. Think more in length than in height. Point your foot, so stretch your toes. Good. Four, three, two, close your feet together and we're gonna hinge forward and bring it all the way up. So I show you the movement from the side here. So as if you wanna sit on imaginary chair, send your hip backwards. When you got that double time. Seven, a long spine is super important here. Four, three, Two, hold it low, and we're gonna reverse it. So we're gonna extend the leg backwards, rond de jambe forward, back, and bring it in again slowly. So extend the outer foot backwards, sweep it to the front, sweep it to the back, and close, double time. Back, front, back, and in. Back, front, back, and in. <laughs> Good. Look diagonally down on the floor. Keep your neck in one extension to the rest of the spine. I got no balance today. Oh. But that's fine. There are some days <laughs> where the balance is not quite good. That's okay. Now, keep your leg extended and we're gonna lift and lower. Up and down. Up, down, up, down. Back leg lift. Don't open your hip. Maybe drop your heel, that's totally fine. Hold it in the air for the pulse for eight. Seven, left leg is long, standing leg is bent. Close your rib, strong core. Four, three, two, one. Now tap to the front and tap to the back. So you lift your upper body and you hinge forward. Good, tap to the front and tap to the back. 
Now, if you want more, lift the leg a little bit higher. Kick forward, kick backwards. Watch out your furniture. <laughs> kick backwards. Kick to the front, Woo. kick to the back. Good, double time, come on. Eight, seven, six, four, three, two more. March it out, relax. Oh gosh, standing leg was burning. Switch over to the other side, amazing work. Don't skip, we need to do the other side. So close your feet together into the six belly position and then lift your heels off the ground, up and down. Remember your posture. The head of the crown is pulling you up. Shoulders low, long and beautiful neck. Strong powerhouse, strong glutes, extended legs, double time, up. Seven, six, heels together. Four, oh, calf muscles. Four, three, hold the heels high and bend the legs. Bend and stretch, bend and stretch. Squeeze your thighs. Good. Imagine you're leaning against the wall. Shoulder blades are still touching the wall. Imprint that spine. So you create a long and relaxed lower back. Just two more. Hold it low with your heels as high as possible. Hinge forward and come all the way up. Hinge forward. Pull the shoulder blades together. Last one slowly. Let's speed it up. Let's go for eight, seven. It's a little belly squat here with your heels lifted all the time. Four, three, two. Hold it high. Let's go for a round de jambe to the back, to the front, and close your feet. Again, so forward the back, keep your pelvis steady and calm. Good, when you got that, then speed it up. Let's go. Front, round de jambe, don't move your hips. Only move the outer leg here. Good. Half time is over, let's go. Four more. Three. If it's too much for your left ankle, drop your heel on the floor, that's fine. Keep your leg at the front, we're gonna lift, lift and lower. Point the right foot. Come on, without swinging, only with control. Hold it at the highest point for eight pulses. Eight, seven, now remember, not to move your spine. Stay strong in your upper body. Four, three, two, and one. Bring your feet together and hinge forward as we did it in the exercise before. And we're gonna reverse the round de jambe slowly. So we're gonna extend backwards. Round de jambe forward, backwards. You already know this movement. Come on, let's speed it up. So we go back, front, back, bring it in. Good. Hinging forward with your upper body for activating your back muscles, okay? Four more. And a three. Imagine you're drawing half circles into the ground and then keep your leg long, we're gonna lift and lower. Don't move into a hollow back. Strong, uh, core is super strong, four more. Three, two, hold it at the highest point. We're gonna pulse it for eight, seven. Don't open, stay parallel here. Spine is steady and calm, four more. Three, two, and one. You're gonna tap forward and backwards. 
So we're gonna combine both sides. Both series here. Maybe drop your standing heel to the floor. That's fine. Maybe you wanna kick in the air. <laughs> I hope you have enough space at home. <laughs> Good, last one slowly. This is your finisher, double time. So lift your upper body and lower. Lift and lower. <sighs> Find your balance, draw the navel in and lift. Just two more. And last one. Close your feet and march it out. Amazing work, team. Thanks for watching. If you like this workout, then let's take it to the next level together. Join our online studio and be part of our weekly live streams via Zoom. Get real-time feedback on your exercises and connect with a community of amazing women. So let's create a workout routine that keeps you committed and motivated. Or continue with this free YouTube workout over here. See you there.